brown last week. <laughs> it's green this week. Hey, water skink. Oh, massive mullet in there. Oh. I don't want to sound like a sexist or anything, but that bridge was shaking more than the uh, North Richmond Bridge in the flood when those girls walked across it. Single bite. You are kidding me. Look, six stitcher. How cool is that? Another keeper. <laughs> Looking at the rubbish more than the fishing now. Nothing, not a single bite. This time of year, this many cast. Unheard of. Anyway, we'll keep moving on. There'll be fish somewhere. Yep. Oh, got him. Got him, got him, got him. Yeah, my first fish. Feels like a little tailor. Oh no, Brim. There you go. All things small grow. And that's what this fishery's got to do again. Thank you, mate. Whoa, 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 whoa. I keep, stop it. I, I've been targeting this since the fish kills the same couple of, or s several spots because it's given me an idea of the growth on the rocks, the fish, all of that. How everything's coming back. That's pretty cool. Cricket ball and a broom. I wasn't going to tell you, but actually found something else too a super bouncy ball ever since I was a kid I love these bouncy balls and this is a glow and dark one the trouble is I end up always doing this and losing them I'm not swimming in for that built these rocks only a few years ago and it's a rubbish catchment I swear medical waste is getting washed up on this this is the same place I got a needle the other day yuck what is that I don't know if it's a needle or not but it's disgusting I'll put it in my box Yeah, it's just become a rubbish collection agency. Look at it. But it just gets through the cracks. So look in the cracks. There's a bottle in every crack. In another four or five years, these cracks are just going to be completely wedged with rubber gloves and needles and bottles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I've had one decent brim follow me all the way back to the bank. I'm getting quite a lot of little bumps here. So my confidence level's raising. But 
just need to do a few switches to see what they really want with the blade it's <laughs> my first decent autumn fish second cast and I got that brim follow me up on the hard body I did not want to leave I live for this oh he's a nice fish but yeah it's just hop 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 shaky shaky oh yeah he's a slab autumn brim are back mate these things keep rolling in from the ocean and that's why I keep coming back to check on them plus to have that rush oh he's not even that big god he carried on he's all right though I'll take him hello mate Come on, spit it. He's not gonna spit it. There you wanna go. Isn't he beautiful? blade that was my second cast god I love these things that's the lure and that's the fish and I mean <laughs> I just love this he's not even that big he just carried on like a highlander That was about the size of the one that followed me in on the hard body. That was cool. Probably the best tip I can give you when you're fishing these blades is to learn your bottom, you know? Put a cheap ass jig head and a little plastic on and cast around. Find your snags. Find where your clear areas are, your muscle beds are. Oh. Time for a respill by look at this. And, uh, Go to work on those areas. So it's just hop, 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 drop. And then what I do is I just check, shake, lift, shake it down, and then go back to work again. That's just to see if there's a fish there. go around to that pipe now I've had that that hook up there I didn't want to leave because I knew there was fish here a few more casts and then we'll move over on the other side to get all that line out oh see that out the back oh yep come on Blade bite, a little flathead. Oh no, broom. So the hop and shake, that's all it takes. And there we go, another broom. G'day mate, how you going? Hey, don't go in the crack. 
You like fishing? Another one. I love the blade bite. I'll fish this pretty well the whole winter, this style. Lot slower. As, as it gets colder, you slow down. At the moment, you can get away with a fairly rapid retrieve. How the hell did that bouncy ball get there? It was in the water. How? Honestly, I don't set these things up. I'll just look down. You see me smack it into the water. If anything, it should be on the edge. Unless there's two bouncy balls. And that was seriously cool. A skeleton. That's a keeper. Did notice this earlier. Now I'm down here, I want to have a look. It's the first seashell that have life in it. But they're actually actually living in there which is good the shells don't look really healthy like that's the color that they should be where am i but he's got an animal in him which is good the tides drop now pretty good so I'm going to walk around to the sand spit over there and see if I can duplicate the bite I just got here. Try and get one or two fish as I walk around and then hopefully go brim brim whiting or something like that. Fish I've ever caught in my life <laughs> on a lure. <laughs> it's like that. Unreal. I love catching things, like I come down here not just to catch fish, but just to look around and explore and like that's just, okay. I, I don't even know what type of fish it is. No, no, look, I'll show you, hold on. I've caught, I just caught a really nice brim. Just let, really? but let him go before he dies. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to, I let them all go. <laughs> but see that? That's amazing. Yeah. yeah. I don't even know what he is, but... <laughs> I'll put him back. Yeah, from anything from big to small, it's like they're all just as important as each other. Hopefully he'll swim away. Nah, he's not looking real good. But anyway, something different, thanks. Yeah, that's the thing, it's a food chain out there. Quite weird. Where is he? Look, he's not. He's not going to swim away. I get a better idea of him. Quite. Oh, no, he's flicking around. What do you think that is? He's beautiful though. Oh, oh mate. Charles, the hook was in his head. Oh, he's trying, he's hardest. The old mate said it'll be food for something else. They should have left him on the hook. Now, I can see why the blades are working. And uh, just one tip, we got wind blowing across. So what I do is I'll cast out there across at the same angle as the wind so I've got a slight belly in my line I don't want to be pointing that way and that way I can control this make that little blade dance this is really good we've got green wheat growing back on the rocks real good sign doesn't smell very nice but it's there yeah, that's a good green leaf. For a 
Joyce just got a hammering, didn't they? This should normally be inundated with whiting, but I haven't had a bite yet. Seems like the mud seems to have more fish on it than the sand. But there's one. <sighs> is it my whiting? A little bremer. I don't know what it is. It's tiny, whatever it is. What are you? Little brem. It's almost like a crossbreed trying to bring in a snapper. Oh, they are sick. No, it's silver rim. It's just me being old eyes. Oh, he's shiny though. He's got a real. Real blue, like a turquoise coming through. That's beautiful. You don't see that, like blue purple as the sun hits. Anyway, watch him go. Bye bye. No, they're not Aboriginal carvings. Up there. Hey, not having fun today, are we? Very quiet. You're really quiet today, mate. Hello. My dad and all his mates used to call me Arry One Tong. Because I'd go around with one thong on. If I broke a thong, I'd just wear the other one. And then eventually I'd walk along and I'd find a, a thong to suit. And I'd have two. Anyway, Havanas. They're nice. Awesome. <laughs>